G'day, welcome to another Curriculum Burst. Here's a curious question for high schoolers. It goes as follows. Let A1, A2, da da da, be a sequence with the following properties. That one, A1 is one, and two, that A2n is n times An for any positive, positive integer n. Okay, I just read that out loud, but don't, didn't really take it in. But the question is, what is the value of A sub two to the 100th power? Oh my goodness, oh my goodness, it feels overwhelming. Um, got a sequence of, uh, sequence of, with the following properties that A, oh, I misread it, A2 is one, and A2n is n times An. And we want, let's write what we want, A to the two to the 100th power. Okay, um, hmm. All right, feels overwhelming. You can tell by my pausing here. So let's see. Um, that's the beginning of the sequence, I guess. A2 is not actually A1, it's A2. And there's some strange property. For example, if I've got 2 times something, then I get the something times An. Uh, well, I guess A to the 200th is actually 2 times something. Uh, that's actually A to the 2 times 2 to the 99th. So if you like, I can then say that A to the 2 to the 100th would be 2 times 2 to the 99. It would have to be 2 to the 99 times A2 to the 99. Hmm. All right, well, now I'm stuck with this one. Um, a 2 to the 99, that is actually 2 times something. That's 2 times 2 to the 98. So it would be uh, 2 times 2 to the 98, 2 to the 98, 2 to the 98. So I've got, still got this part, times 2 to the 98 times a 2 to the 98. So I've got that one to work out. Hmm. Do you know what? You know what? Uh, this, these numbers are too overwhelming. In fact, I'm going to do strategy number five. Let's solve a smaller version of this same problem. Rather than starting with big powers of 2, let's start with the small powers of 2 and sort of work our way up. For example, a2 is definitely 1. a2 squared, that's a4, that's uh, 2 times 2. 2 times 2, so it would be 2 times a2. 2 times a2, which is just 2. Uh, a2 cubed would be 2, that's 8, so it's 2 times 4, so it would be uh, 4 times a to the f 4. Uh, two times, well, let, sorry, let me keep it in terms of powers of 2, so that seems to be key here. It's 2 times 2 squared, so it'll be uh, 2 squared times a to the 2 squared, which we just worked out is 2 squared times 2, okay, which I guess is 2 cubed again. Um, a2 to the 4th is 2 times 2 cubed, so it'll be 2 cubed times a2 to the cubed. We just worked out that, so it's uh, 2 cubed times 2 squared times 2, just copying that part, which is 2 cubed times 2 cubed, which is 2 to the 6. You know what, I kind of like this part. I kind of like that a lot. In fact, we can't, oh, oh, sorry, might might just have a little epiphany. We kind of seeing decreasing powers of 2 multiplied together appearing here. And that was also happening up here. I think I can see what a 2 to the 100th is going to be now. I bet I could work out an answer for it. Then I have to actually work out it's going to be a product of powers of twos, but then I think I know what to do with that product of powers of two. So I'm going to stop right there. I'm feeling excited. I feel like I've just, just had a breakthrough with this question in my brain. I hope I'm actually right with it. So what I'm going to invite you to do, try to work out an expression of two to the 100th power as a product of powers of two like this, and then actually work out the number. See if you can do it. That's going to be way cool. And when you get there, check the answer that goes with this essay. Well, let's compare results. Hmm, this, this feels good. All right, thanks very much. Thanks for watching. For more curriculum inspirations material, go to our website. Lots of great stuff there.